want. You want guys to play well. Parker had a tremendous week in practice. The, the game's physical, as you saw, which isn't always necessarily boots uh, MO. But uh, you know, when he got an opportunity, he scrapped and, and did his thing. So um, more, more of a timing thing, I think, trying to get to halftime. And, and then he made some plays for us in the second half. He's not buried or anything. It was just kind of individual matchups, and I thought Parker was probably better defensively. Are you in favor of this classic continuing uh, indefinitely? I'm not going to. Yeah, I don't. Again, my opinion's not really important <laughs> unless somebody uh, up the food chain here asks me my opinion. <laughs> I'll, I'll just stay in trouble. Switzerland. Uh, well, a really good player named Yoli Childs that I don't know that uh, too many people were going to stop him. That's number one. Uh, I, overall, defensively, we weren't bad. We really weren't bad. If you can take Yoli out of the equation, I thought we did a decent job on people. Uh, you know, it was the, the amount of points that we needed to, need, we needed to score more uh, at the end of the day. But our defensive effort, I don't think, is great. great of the result. Yep. Really successful, it was only success of matter matchups, or was it just? I mean, you saw it. You t you tell me. I don't know who would have you know who would have been guarding him, but he slung up some shots and uh, hit open shots, hit tough shots. A lot of a lot of credit goes to him. So I know we didn't have anybody that could stop him, and there were times we sent two guys at him, and he still couldn't stop him. So he's a willing passer. He makes. Uh, puts you in a dilemma as a coaching staff anytime you play him. Are you going to play him head up, straight up? And uh, if you don't, he's, again, he's one of the most willing passers. They do a really good job moving the ball. And sometimes you want to see how he gets it cooking. And at the point that we realized he had it cooking, we doubled him. And then he made people around him better, too. You had some trouble getting it off, the ball into the post. I mean, is this, is this difficult to try to manage a different offense than what you're used to? Well, we no. We need to get more out of our big guys. There's no, but there's not. It's not specific. Again, I don't want our players thinking that we're, you know, going after. Them. There's not a person, one through five, uh, one through fifteen, that doesn't need to give us a lot more. And in order to feed the post, it takes two parts. Um, we need to get more production out of a lot of guys. And I think, uh, in order to be a successful team, you have to have a post presence, for sure. And uh, we'll address that. We'll get after it.